Um, well, it covers the first nine and a half chapters of the book of Genesis. Um, it is the story, the first act is the story of Adam and Eve, and the second act is the story of Noah. And tell me who, let me start again. Tell me who you are and which character you are. Um, I play Adam, and in the second act, I play Noah. What's it like playing those two characters? Those are pretty significant characters. Yeah. Yeah, they are. Um, it's, it's pretty intense. <laughs> um, I, it's been a, a really great experience doing it. What does Adam, what, talk, talk to me first about Adam. What, what does Adam go through? Um, well, Adam starts out and he's very much like a child. Both Adam and Eve are very much like a child. So throughout, throughout the first act, it's really going through the stages of growing up. Um, and then for Noah, Noah is already grown up when, when we meet him. Um, so it's, it's, it's kind of cool to, to be able to go through growing up on stage and, and all of the, the emotions and changes that a person goes through as, as they're developing and, and, um, and, and even raising children and, so. And how do you set that to music? I mean, it's, it's such a raw story to begin with. Um, <laughs> it's... I, I don't even know. The music is, is amazing. Um, the music is, is wonderful, and it really, um, it really drives the, the whole feel of the show. Um, and there's so much music. I think in some instances, um, it's safe to say that the music is a way to express something that can't, it, it's so much more yeah. than just saying it. Mm -hmm. Like it's like um, creation and, and the magic in you and the yearning in you, you can't just say it, you, you have to sing it and it has to come out in a song and it, it's just so much more moving. It, it reflects what's going on so much more on the in, internally mm -hmm. than just saying it. Yeah. Have you ever tried to connect to these characters in the Bible before? <laughs> these are I mean, no. <laughs> I mean, you know, everyone blames Eve all the time for you know barren children and like, oh, you know, darn Eve. But uh, never tried. I mean, on the real level, to ever identify with somebody like that. Now, what do you do in the second act? Are you in the second act as well? Yeah, I'm. I'm Eve in the first act, and then I play Mama Noah in the second act. Um, and the second act takes us uh, through the story of Noah and the Ark, and um, so basically a mankind is doomed again and so and then uh there, it's a renewal process and uh it turns out okay in the end but it takes us to the ark and building it and the animals coming and it's really exciting and the chorus plays so much different roles it's really really fun um but it takes place all on a boat so as an audience does the audience is it, is it entertaining is it dramatic is it how do you describe what does the audience uh. need to know um, I think that the audience needs to know that it's very entertaining, um, but it's all, and, it, and it has such a positive message. This show has such a positive message. And I would become prepared f feeling to be able to cry and like just feeling a lot. It takes you through a lot of up and downs, emotional up and downs. You're very happy, childlike in the beginning, but also you get scorned by God and God casts you aside and it's very, very emotional and lots of different relationships, father and son and mother and son. and it's, siblings and there's death but there's rebirth too so um come have you know be prepared to have fun and uh, also to cry but also to laugh too the best of everything good tell me about working with each other oh it's terrible <laughs> <laughs> it's terrible she's picky oh my gosh <laughs> no it's been really fun <laughs> no it's been it's it's been fun to play these roles together um Adam and Adam and Eve go through a lot of the same things, and yeah. it's just he's like always a step behind me. Like I first reach adolescence, and then I'm pulling kind of you. Well, you choose to go into adolescence, but um, it's been fun. Yeah, we've learned together and learned how to be a child together. That was hard. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Form that connection. How about the rest of the cast? What does the rest of the cast bring to this? Um, the rest of the cast Three are things. storytellers, um, so they're they really the <laughs> they're narrating yeah. the story as it's happening. Um, and they're watching the whole thing and taking part in it um, and really bringing this, helping to bring the story to life. Um, 
Yeah. 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 They're, they're everything. <laughs> I mean, without the yeah. storytellers, it yeah. would be nothing. They're awesome. And they, they portray so many different... They, they're the snake. Um, they're they're the all storm, the animals. The animals. They're the storm. They're, they feel they, the wrath of God they feel with us. Yeah. Like, they, they reflect kind of what the audience is seeing. So sometimes you interact with them and sometimes you just kind of know they're there. Right? Yeah, exactly. Yes, yes okay. exactly. Okay, I guess just um, last question. Why should people come see the show? Go ahead, James. Why should people come see the show? <laughs> um, people should come see the show because it's, it's just, it's amazing. Um, it's, it's, the music is is beautiful and it's passionate and and there's there's so much in these stories. Um, I, this is the story of how everything began. And yeah, there's I mean, just if you, so much there. If you believe in life and you rejoice living in life, come see this show because it's all about that. It's about second chances. It's about forgiveness and second chances and um, the relationships we have and how important that is mm -hmm. in life. And um, it's a very positive message. Come see it because you're going to have fun, and you're also going to get a very positive message from this.